Naked Rancher here from my Women Rancher series. Catherine McHale Slaughterhouse, better known in life as Rattlesnake Kate, was born in 1893 on the Colorado prairies. Her mother passed away early on and her father raised four children expecting them to do everything needed on their homestead. She went to nursing school and after that was a nurse at Army Hospital Number 21 before the Army started naming hospitals. She decided that being a nurse was not the profession that she wanted, so she bought her own land, 640 acres. And even though she went through two divorces, she basically lived on that ranch alone, even though she did adopt a friend's little boy and raised him as her own. One time she heard shooting out by her pond and took her horse, her rifle, and her little boy on her saddle with her and rode out to the pond. There she came across a rattlesnake that she killed and upset a whole slew of other ones because in two hours she killed over 140 rattlesnakes and she took those rattlesnakes home, hung them up, eventually skinned them and became famous not only across the nation but internationally for all of these rattlesnakes. She made an outfit out of her snake skins plus other accoutrements like earrings, jewelry, things like that. And she also realized that the venom was an important part of healthcare and that it was a valuable necessity. Well, she did that for a while, but didn't make enough money from it and realized that she'd have to sell off some of her property just to make ends meet. She lived through and sustained herself through the Dust Bowl time period, the Great Depression, and World War II. Here's a quote that she always said that her father told the children when they were growing up. Her homestead is now a museum in Greenlee, Colorado, where you can see her rattlesnake dress and the history about her. Make a rancher out.